Ladies and gentlemen, doubt is one of the most insidious forces we face in life. It creeps in from the outside world, whispered by those who don't see our vision or shouted by those who think they know our limits better than we do. But here's the truth, doubt is nothing more than noise. It has no real power, no substance unless we let it. Silencing the noise of doubt begins with recognizing that it doesn't define who we are or what we're capable of achieving. When people doubt you, it often says more about them than it does about you. Their words may come from their fears, insecurities, or inability to imagine something greater than their own experiences. Their lack of belief is not your burden to carry. You don't owe them your potential, you owe it to yourself. So the first step to silencing the noise is learning to separate yourself from their voices. Understand that their opinions are not facts, they are merely reflections of their own limitations. But external doubt isn't the only kind we face. Sometimes the loudest, most persistent voice of doubt comes from within. It's that nagging thought in the back of your mind that says, what if I fail? What if I'm not enough? This internal noise can be the hardest to silence because it feels personal, it comes from you. But just because the thought exists doesn't mean it's true. You have to challenge it. You have to remind yourself of your strengths, your progress, and your ability to grow. Self-doubt thrives and silence starve it by speaking positivity, faith, and determination into your life. Silencing doubt doesn't mean you'll never hear it again. It means learning not to give it a seat at your table. Think of it like static on a radio station. When you tune into the wrong frequency, all you hear is noise. But when you adjust the dial, you find clarity. Your focus is that adjustment. When you focus on your goals, your vision, and your actions, the noise begins to fade into the background. It's still there, but it no longer controls your attention or your energy. The most powerful tool in silencing doubt is action. When you take consistent steps toward your dreams, you create evidence of your capabilities. Each accomplishment, no matter how small, is a victory over doubt. You prove to yourself that you are capable, that you are worthy, and that you have what it takes to succeed. Action turns I think I can into I know I can. Finally, surround yourself with people who believe in you and your vision. The right support system can amplify your confidence and drown out negativity. Choose relationships that challenge you to grow and push you to reach your highest potential. With the right people in your corner, doubt becomes a faint whisper instead of a defining roar. Doubt will always exist, but its power is only as strong as you allow it to be. Silence the noise and watch yourself thrive. Too often, people become fixated on proving others wrong. They let the doubts, criticisms, or negativity of others drive their actions, shaping their goals around disproving naysayers. While this can be a powerful motivator, it's not a sustainable foundation for success. True fulfillment comes not from silencing critics, but from validating your own belief in yourself. It's about proving yourself right, not just proving others wrong. When you focus solely on proving others wrong, you hand over control of your journey to them. Your energy becomes tied to their opinions and your success is measured by their reactions. What happens when they stop doubting you? What happens when their opinions shift or they simply stop paying attention? If your motivation relies on their skepticism, you risk losing your drive and sense of purpose. Instead, centering your efforts on proving yourself right keeps the focus where it belongs on your goals, values, and personal growth. Proving yourself right means aligning your actions with your own vision for your life. It's about setting goals that resonate with your passions and working toward them because they matter to you. This approach fosters intrinsic motivation, the kind that pushes you forward regardless of external validation. When you're driven by your belief in yourself and your purpose, the opinions of others become irrelevant. Success is no longer about impressing anyone else, it's about fulfilling your potential and living authentically. This mindset shift also allows for greater resilience. When your focus is inward, Setbacks and challenges are less likely to derail you. You're not trying to meet someone else's expectations, you're pursuing something deeply personal. Each obstacle becomes an opportunity to learn, grow, and strengthen your resolve. You prove yourself right not by avoiding failure, but by persevering through it and coming out stronger on the other side. Moreover, proving yourself right creates a sense of empowerment. 
It reinforces the idea that you are in control of your destiny. Every time you achieve a milestone, no matter how small, you validate your own efforts and abilities. This builds confidence and momentum, fueling even greater accomplishments. You're no longer looking over your shoulder to see who's watching or waiting for applause. You're focused on the road ahead, knowing that your work speaks for itself. The act of proving yourself right also inspires others. When people see you living with purpose and determination, they're drawn to your authenticity. You become a role model, showing that success is possible when you believe in yourself and stay true to your vision. This kind of influence is far more powerful and lasting than simply silencing critics. Ultimately, proving yourself right is about honoring your journey. It's about trusting in your abilities, following your passion, and working hard for the life you want to create. Let others doubt if they must their opinions are not your responsibility. What matters is that you wake up each day with the conviction that you are on the right path and that your success is a testament to your own belief in yourself. Every person is born with a unique gift, a talent, or a passion that sets them apart from everyone else. But recognizing that gift is only the first step. True greatness comes from nurturing and investing time, energy, and effort to transform potential into purpose and purpose into impact. Many people go through life unaware of their gift, either because they've never looked inward or because they've allowed fear and doubt to overshadow their potential. But the truth is, discovering and cultivating your gift is one of the most rewarding journeys you can undertake. To recognize your gift, you must start by paying attention to what makes you feel alive. It's the thing you're naturally drawn to, the activity that makes time disappear, and the skill that others admire in you, even if you don't yet see it yourself. Sometimes your gift is hidden in plain sight, overshadowed by the distractions of daily life or dismissed because it doesn't fit into conventional expectations. But your gift doesn't have to be flashy or grand. It simply has to be authentic to you. Whether it's creativity, problem solving, leadership, compassion, or perseverance, your gift is valuable and worth exploring. Once you've identified your gift, nurturing it becomes the key to unlocking its full potential. Nurturing your gift requires discipline and intentionality. It's not enough to recognize that you're good at something you have to commit to developing it. This means practicing, learning, and refining your abilities consistently. Even the most talented individuals must work tirelessly to hone their skills. Natural ability can only take you so far dedication and effort are what elevate a gift to greatness. Part of nurturing your gift is also embracing the challenges that come with it. Growth often requires stepping out of your comfort zone and facing moments of doubt or failure. These moments are not setbacks, they are opportunities to strengthen your resolve and improve your craft. Every stumble, every mistake, every criticism is a stepping stone toward mastery. By viewing challenges as part of the process, you build resilience and deepen your commitment to your journey. Another essential aspect of nurturing your gift is using it to serve others. Your talent is not just for you, it's meant to make a positive impact on the world. Whether it's through creating art, solving problems, teaching, or leading, your gift has the power to inspire, uplift, and transform lives. When you align your gift with a greater purpose, you amplify its potential, and create a legacy that extends beyond yourself. Finally, surround yourself with people who encourage and support your growth. The right environment can fuel your passion and keep you motivated, while negative influences can stifle your progress. Seek out mentors, collaborators, and friends who believe in your vision and challenge you to reach higher. Recognizing and nurturing your gift is not just a responsibility, it's a privilege. It's about honoring what makes you unique and using it to create a life of purpose, fulfillment, and impact. When you invest in your gift, you invest in yourself and the world around you becomes better for it. Adversity is an inevitable part of life. It comes in many forms, unexpected challenges, failures, setbacks, or hardships. While these moments can be painful and discouraging, they also hold the potential to shape us into stronger, wiser, and more resilient individuals. Persevering through adversity isn't just about surviving difficult times, it's about using those experiences to grow, to learn, and to push closer to our goals. When faced with adversity, the first and most crucial step is to acknowledge it. Pretending difficulties don't exist or trying to avoid them only prolongs the struggle. 
Acknowledgement doesn't mean surrender. It means facing the challenge head on with the mindset that you have the strength to overcome it. Recognizing adversity for what it is, a temporary obstacle allows you to approach it with clarity and determination. Perseverance requires a shift in perspective. Adversity often feels like an insurmountable wall, but with the right mindset, it can be seen as a stepping stone. Each obstacle teaches a lesson, even if it's painful or uncomfortable in the moment. Failure, for example, is not the end, it's a teacher. It shows us what didn't work and points us toward what might. Resilience grows when we embrace these lessons instead of running from them. A key element of persevering through adversity is maintaining a sense of purpose. Challenges can make us question our path, but staying connected to our why keeps us grounded. Why did you start this journey? What do you hope to achieve? Holding on to that vision provides the motivation to keep going. Even when the road gets tough, purpose acts as an anchor, reminding us that the struggle is part of a greater story and that the destination is worth the effort. Adversity also calls for flexibility. Plans will go awry and expectations may not always be met. Perseverance doesn't mean stubbornly clinging to a single approach. It means adapting when circumstances change. Flexibility allows us to pivot, to find new strategies, and to continue moving forward even when the original plan no longer works. It's about being resourceful and creative, finding strength in the ability to adjust rather than break. Support systems play a vital role in perseverance. No one succeeds alone, and reaching out for help is not a sign of weakness, but of strength. Whether it's friends, family, mentors, or colleagues, having people in your corner can make all the difference. They provide encouragement, perspective, and sometimes the push you need to keep going when you feel like giving up. Finally, perseverance through adversity is about trusting the process. Success doesn't happen overnight and progress is rarely linear. There will be moments of doubt, but those moments are part of the journey. Each step, no matter how small, brings you closer to your goal. The key is to keep moving forward to rise after every fall, to try again after every failure, and to hold on to hold, on to hold on to hope, even in the darkest moments. Adversity is a test of character, but it's also an opportunity. By persevering, you discover your strength, build resilience, and prove to yourself that no challenge is greater than your determination. In a world filled with noise, promises, and grand declarations, it's easy to fall into the trap of believing that words alone can create change or inspire others. But true leadership and influence come not from what you say, but from what you do. Leading with actions, not words, is about embodying the values, principles, and commitment that you want others to see. It's about showing, not just telling and letting your example speak louder than anything you could ever say. Words can inspire, but they are fleeting without action to back them up. People listen to what you say, but they believe what you do. If your actions contradict your words, trust erodes and your credibility weakens. On the other hand, when your actions consistently align with your values, you build integrity and inspire confidence in others. Leading with actions means living your truth even when no one is watching. It means being the same person in private as you are in public and letting your life be the proof of your character. Actions have a way of cutting through doubt and skepticism. When people see you working hard, staying consistent, and staying true to your commitments, they don't need you to convince them of your dedication, they can see it for themselves. For example, a leader who asks their team to put in extra effort during a challenging time earns respect by rolling up their sleeves and contributing just as much, if not more, than anyone else. Their actions create a ripple effect, motivating others to follow their example without needing to be told. Leading with actions also requires patience and persistence. Words can create an immediate impression, but actions take time to build momentum and make an impact. It's about the small, consistent efforts that add up over time, showing up every day, putting in the work, and staying committed to your goals. These actions demonstrate discipline and reliability, qualities that inspire others to trust and follow you. Another essential aspect of leading with actions is accountability. Everyone makes mistakes, but leaders who take responsibility for their actions show humility and strength. Owning up to your missteps, learning from them, and making corrections speaks volumes about your character. 
It demonstrates that you're not just invested in success, but in growth and improvement. This principle applies to all areas of life, not just leadership roles. Whether you're striving to inspire your family, support your friends, or achieve personal goals, actions matter more than promises. If you want to show love, don't just say it, express it through kindness, time, and care. If you want to succeed, don't just talk about your dreams, put in the effort to make them a reality. Ultimately, leading with actions is about being authentic and intentional. It's about aligning your behavior with your aspirations and letting your deeds be a testament to your commitment. Words can fade, but the impact of your actions leaves a lasting legacy, inspiring others to follow your path and believe in the power of integrity and effort. Dreaming big is the starting point of every great achievement. It's about looking beyond your current circumstances and daring to envision a life full of possibilities. Big dreams challenge the status quo and push the boundaries of what you believe is possible. They ignite a fire within you, giving you a sense of purpose and direction. However, dreaming alone is not enough. Dreams without effort remain fantasies, and achieving them requires an unwavering commitment to work hard. Along the way, staying humble ensures that success doesn't distance you from your values or the people who support you. Big dreams are often met with skepticism, some might call them unrealistic or far-fetched, but that's what makes them worth pursuing. A big dream forces you to grow. It requires you to develop skills, overcome obstacles, and transform into the person capable of achieving it. The size of your dream doesn't matter to others, it matters to you. Whether it's starting a business, mastering a skill, or making a difference in your community, the vision must come from within. A big dream gives you something to strive for, a reason to get up every day and take meaningful action. Working hard is where the magic happens. It's in the countless hours of practice, the late nights, the sacrifices, and the resilience in the face of failure. Hard work bridges the gap between where you are and where you want to be. It's not glamorous, and it's often unrecognized, but it's the foundation of success. Every small step you take brings you closer to your dream, even if progress feels slow or invisible. Hard work requires discipline and consistency, qualities that separate those who achieve their dreams from those who merely wish for them. But success isn't just about dreaming big and working hard, it's also about staying humble. Humility keeps you grounded, reminding you that no one achieves greatness alone. Along the journey, you'll encounter people who support, teach, and inspire you. Recognizing their contributions and remaining grateful ensures that your success doesn't isolate you. Humility also allows you to keep learning and growing. When you acknowledge that there's always room for improvement, you remain open to feedback and new perspectives, which ultimately make you better. Staying humble also keeps you connected to your purpose. Big dreams often come with big rewards, but those rewards can be fleeting if they overshadow your core values. Humility ensures that success doesn't lead to arrogance or entitlement. It reminds you to give back, to lift others up, and to use your achievements as a way to make a positive impact on the world. The combination of dreaming big, working hard, and staying humble creates a balanced path to success. It fuels ambition while grounding you in authenticity. It allows you to aim high while appreciating the journey and those who help you along the way. When you embrace this mindset, you not only achieve your goals, but also inspire others to chase their dreams and live with purpose.